With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Three blocks of mass M1, M2 and M3 are connected as shown in the figure. All the surfaces are frictionless and the strings and pulleys are light. Find the acceleration of the mass M1. So let's take the mass of the uh, mass M1 acceleration as A. So this pulley will also have an acceleration A downward. So if I saw with respect to the frame of the pulley, the, these two blocks will be acted by a pseudo force of M2A in upward direction and M3A in upward direction. Simple. And with respect to the pulley, let's suppose this block is having an acceleration of A dash in downward direction and this block is having an acceleration of A dash in upward direction. So here the tension is T, T and uh, this pulley is massless so the tension in this string will be 2T. You can see already since the pulley is massless so this is t this is t so this will be t dash net force on the pulley should be zero so t dash should be equal to 2t now if i write the force equation on these two blocks and the third block also i will write m2 g and t and m2a is acting upward right so i will right minus m2 a minus t is equals to m2 into a dash for the m3 mass block i will write t plus m3 a minus m3 g is equals to m3 a dash simple now we want uh, the acceleration of that block right so i will write the force equation on the upper block also so i will write 2t is equals to m1 into a dash right okay so if i replace if i want to replace this a from here right so what i will do i will multiply the equation one with m3 and equation 2 with m2 and i will add them then what will happen this a term will get cancelled out right so i will write equation 1 into m3 plus equation 2 into m1 m2 so after adding the two i will get m2 m3 g minus m2 m3 a minus m3 t is equals to m2 m3 a dash plus m2 times of this so i will write m2 t plus m2 m3 a minus m2 m3 g and here i will add m2 m3 a dash simple now you can add the two equation and after adding this a term will get cancelled out right and uh, we will get 2 m2 m3 g and uh, plus i will write m2 minus m3 into t is equals to 2 m2 m3 a dash simple so this will be the term now you could solve it for t and a dash since we have two equation and two variable if you see this is equation third and this equation is fourth so, so we could solve the two equation to get the a dash value right we want this a dash so i will write here i will replace this t rather by m a dash by 2 right i will write in the place of t t 
एम ए डैश बाई टू इज इक्व टू या सो आई आई पुट द वैल्यू हि नाउ यू कैन सॉल्व इट सो आई विल मल्टीप्लाई द होल बाई टू देन आई विल गेट फोर एम टू एम थ्री जी इज इक्व टू सो इन द लेफ्ट साइड आई विल गेट फोर एम टू एम थ्री प्लस इट विल बी एम टू सो इट वॉज एम वन right so i will write here m1 so m2 m1 minus m3 m1 yeah so this will be the term in bracket into a dash now you can see the value of a dash you can calculate the a dash is equals to 4 m2 m3 g by 4 m2 m3 plus m1 m2 minus m1 m3 this will be the acceleration of the block of mass m1 you can see the question again this was our question and we found the acceleration is this thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today